Mr. Chairman, I uh, did not plan to, but I'd like to follow up on the gentlewoman's comments and assertions about Romania and Hunter Biden uh, and the fact that he worked for a Romanian executive facing corruption charges. The problem with that is that Rudy Giuliani also worked for that person and a former FBI director. And I'd like to ask unanimous consent that a New York Times piece entitled Giuliani is drawing attention to Hunter Biden's work in Romania, but there is a problem be entered into the record. Without objection, so ordered. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. Um, I want to go back to this Burisma theory because it seems to me that if that's what's triggered all of this, and we are sitting here now wasting precious time while the country is about to shut down, and it's all found its genesis with Rudy Giuliani, that we ought to have Rudy Giuliani here. Now, I know there was a uh, motion made earlier. I'd like to disaggregate that motion without mentioning the other person's name and offer a motion again that Rudy Giuliani be required to come before this committee. Is there a second? And Mr. Chairman, I'd like to ask that the clock be paused while the... Pa pause the clock. Thank you. Mr. Grofman, Chair Recognize Mr. Grofman. Motion to table. Motion uh, made to table by Mr. Grofman. Is there a second? Second by Ms. Fox. So I guess we'll have a vote on uh, Mr. Grofman's motion to table Mr. Bafume's motion. This is about Giuliani, right? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll do this by voice vote. All those in favor say I like aye. Recorded vote, Mr. Chairman. Aye. Mr. All those Chairman, opposed, no. Recorded. No. He's requested a recorded in vote. In the opinion of the chair, the motion has it. The ayes. I'd request a recorded Mr. vote now. I request a recorded vote, Mr. Chairman. Will the clerk please get ready to have a recorded vote? Another motion by. The minority party. <laughs> Chair, recognize Mr. Palmer. I, I can't hear you. There's a motion for a temporary recess. Is there a second? Motion second. Um, uh, all those Mr. Chairman, there's already, there's already a motion on the floor. There's already a motion on the floor. I'd like a report at 12 o'clock. We would give them a bathroom break. There's already a motion on the floor. There is a motion and it's mine. Okay. Point. All right, we'll, with the clerk, clerk, please report. Call the roll. Will the clerk call the roll? To be clear, this is on the motion to table Mr. Mfume's motion to, for unanimous consent to call Rudy Giuliani as a witness before the Oversight Committee. Is that right? That's, that, that is correct. Okay. Mr. Jordan. Mr. Jordan votes aye. Mr. Turner, Mr. Gosar, Ms. Fox, Ms. Fox votes aye. Mr. Grothman, Mr. Grothman votes aye. Mr. Palmer, Mr. Palmer votes aye. Mr. Higgins, Mr. Higgins votes aye. Mr. Sessions. Mr. Sessions votes aye. Mr. Biggs. Mr. Biggs votes aye. Ms. Mace. Mr. Chairman, what are we voting on? I'm, I'm this is a motion by Mr. Grofman to, to table the motion by Mr. Mifume to subpoena Rudy Giuliani. Got it. Doesn't seem to have a lot to do with this. Um, I'll vote aye. Mm. Ms. Mace votes aye. Mr. LaTurner. Mr. LaTurner votes aye. Mr. Fallon. Mr. Donalds. Mr. Armstrong. Mr. Armstrong votes yes. Mr. Perry. Mr. Timmons. Mr. Burchett. Ms. Green. Ms. McLean. Ms. McLean votes aye. Ms. Bobert. Mr. Fry. 
Mr. Fry votes aye. Miss Luna. Mr. Edwards. Mr. Edwards votes aye. Mr. Langworthy. Mr. Burleson. Mr. Burleson votes aye. Mr. Raskin. No. Mr. Raskin votes no. Miss Norton. No. No. Miss Norton votes no. Mr. Lynch. No. Mr. Lynch votes no. Mr. Connolly. Mr. Krishnamorthy. Mr. Khanna. Mr. Mfume. Mfume votes no. Mr. Mfume votes no. Ms. Acasio Cortez. Nay. Ms. Acasio Cortez votes nay. Ms. Porter. No. Ms. Porter votes no. Ms. Bush. Mr. Gomez. Mr. Gomez votes no. Ms. Brown. Ms. Stansbury. Ms. Stansbury votes no. Mr. Garcia. Mr. Garcia votes no. Mr. Frost. Mr. Frost votes no. Ms. Lee. Ms. Lee votes no. Mr. Kassar. Mr. Kassar votes no. Ms. Crockett. No. Ms. Crockett votes no. Mr. Goldman. Mr. Moskowitz. Mr. Moskowitz votes no. Ms. Talib. Ms. Talib votes no. Mr. Chairman. Chairman votes aye. How is Mr. Fallon from Texas recorded? Mr. Chairman votes aye. Mr. Fallon is not yet recorded. Aye. Um, Mr. Fallon votes aye. How is Mr. Langworthy from New York recorded? Mr. Langworthy is not recorded. Mr. Langworthy votes aye. How is Mr. Timmons from South Carolina recorded? Mr. Timmons is not yet recorded. Mr. Timmons votes aye. How is Mr. Gosar from Arizona recorded? Mr. Gosar is not recorded. Mr. Gosar votes aye. Mr. Connolly is not yet recorded. Mr. Connolly votes no. Mr. Krishnamurthy is not yet recorded. Mr. Krishnamurthy votes no. How's Mr. Armstrong recorded? Mr. Armstrong is voted aye. Mr. Chairman, how am I recorded? Ms. Mace is recorded as voting aye. How is Mr. Donalds from Florida recorded? Mr. Donalds is not yet recorded. Mr. Donalds votes yes. Madam Clerk, how am I recorded? Oh, good. Oh, have I been recorded, Madam Clerk? It's uh, Mr. Raskin. Mr. Raskin, you are recorded as voting no. Mr. Gomez, you're recorded as voting no. How am I recorded? Uh, Congresswoman Ocasio-Cortez, how am I recorded? Ms. Ocasio-Cortez is recorded as voting no. How am I recorded? Ms. Brown is not yet recorded. Okay. Ms. Brown votes no. Uh, let, will the clerk please tally the votes? Mr. Chairman, on this vote, the ayes are 20, the nays are 18. The motion to table passes. Mr. Bafuma, you're recognized for your final three and a half minutes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I reclaim my time and I ask the question, where in the world is Rudy Giuliani? That's how we got here, ladies and gentlemen. And this committee is afraid to bring him before us and put him on the record. Shame. And the question was raised, what does this have to do with it? It has everything to do with it. Professor Gearhart, in your testimony, you said in every impeachment inquiry beforehand, the House has identified some credible evidence of wrongdoing committed by a targeted president. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Professor Gearhart, are impeachment, impeachment inquiries typically utilized 
as a frontline tool to go fishing or for the first time go seeking evidence? Uh, no, sir. Professor Gerhardt, would you say that House Republicans have made an unprecedented overreach of congressional power? Uh, it, it strikes me that it is, yes. And Mr. Gerhardt, would you say it's fair to assume that the extreme MAGA Republicans in particular have misused, if not abused, committee's resources and the taxpayer dollars in this prolonged investigation that has gone on for almost a year, subpoenaing documents, having hearings, providing boxes of evidence, and no wrongdoing? Um, sir, I appreciate the question. I'm not sure who the MAGA Republicans are. So. I can point them out to you. <laughs> Mr. Now, Chairman. Here's, here's the, here's Mr. Chairman, uh, I would ask that, that the gentleman please point out the Republicans he's referring to. He said he could. This is, I'm reclaiming my time. Ladies and gentlemen, this clock is showing what's happening to our country while we debate over and over and over again not any wrongdoing by President Biden, but trying to link what his son may or may not have done to him. People are going to be hurt when this time runs out. This is not the Wizard of Oz when all of a sudden she turns over the hourglass while the Wicked Witch is standing there. These are children. These are women. These are military officers and soldiers and civilians. These are law enforcement officers. These are senior citizens looking for paychecks for Social Security. Why in the hell are we playing this game? And why don't we be honest? If it were so important, it could wait. This is what is important, protecting this government and protecting the people who pay taxes here. But we want to play games with all of this. So where is Rudy Giuliani right now? I'd like to know. And I'd like to know why we can't bring him before this committee, like we've brought these witnesses and everybody else. I yield back hey, my Mr. time to the ranking member. Well, I want to thank the distinguished gentleman from Baltimore for his uh, passionate and lucid comments here. Um, and I, I appreciate the fact that you introduced a motion to subpoena Giuliani before I'd introduced a motion to subpoena Giuliani and Lev Parnas. And Lev Parnas wrote us a long letter saying that all of this is based on a fraud, a tissue of fraud. He went all over the world with Rudy Giuliani looking to is, find is dirt. Is he alleging the China money but, was a fraud? I'm, are you asking Romanian me to yield? Money? Are you asking yeah. me to yield? It's a, I, I'm happy to yield for a second. What, what, what is your question, Mr. Chairman? What, what fraud are you? Well, you, uh, I've introduced it in the record in case you haven't read it yet, the letter that Lev Parnas wrote to you and to me. In it, he called upon you to call off this wild goose chase. Because of China money that the Bidens have received? No, because all of this is based on the Burisma conspiracy. The, the China, China money is based on the Burisma conspiracy. Well, I've seen you're, a lot of China the, money. Mr. Mufume's time's expired. You can, someone to. can yield. Now, uh, Dr. Fox.